Good afternoon, everybody. Dr. Peterson here with Modern Foot and Ankle, working out of Celebration and Orlando, Florida. Here to discuss recent injury of running back uh, Rashad Penny with the Seattle Seahawks, suffering an unfortunate and catastrophic injury to his left lower leg uh, while playing against the New Orleans Saints. Yikes. Really tough injury, okay? And uh, don't know the details specifically of, of, um, of his ankle fracture, but in general, his injury likely occurred through what's referred to as a supination external rotation fracture pattern force, okay? And what that consists of, with the foot remaining in a fixed or a slightly inverted as such position, and then the, the, uh, the ankle and the lower leg, as you can see in the, in, the, in the previous picture that's posted, it tends to rotate externally as such, okay? And now mind you, the ankle is not supposed to move in this fashion, okay? So what will happen is, just a, a quick recap from last, uh, last podcast, you're going to begin with injuring the front part of the ankle, okay? And you're gonna either rupture the ligament here, the anterior inferior tibial fibular ligament, or you can have what's referred to the injury to the distal tibia, okay? The uh, telosha putt fracture, avulsion fracture, or the wax down for the fort, the, the fort. Now in this case, if you fractured his, his fibula, he didn't have an avulsion fracture, right? So that's the next uh, portion of this fracture pattern is that he'll likely have above the ankle joint syndesmosum, uh, he'll have a spiral or perhaps even a butterfly fracture fragment, really tough. Now, if this injury continued in this fashion, he can also injure the back of his ankle or his tibia, producing what's known as a, a Volkmann's fracture or a, a, a Volkmann's injury there. Um, <clears throat> you know, extremely difficult injury, once again, uh, typically, what we would do to repair this would be placing an interfragmentary screw, compressing the fracture fragments themselves, um, and then we'll put some sort of uh, an anti-glide or a neutralization plate to keep this fracture from rotating, destabilizing. And then once again, uh, we can choose to use either a screw fixation or a flexible fixation for the uh, for the ankle uh, ankle the high ankle sprain and syndesmosis component. Uh, really tough injury. Clearly, this is a season ender. And unfortunately, it's not Rashad Penny's first major injury in 2019. I think he ruptured his ACL from one of his knees. You know, uh, really, really difficult injury. Um, really, really uh, hoping for a speedy recovery for him, his team, and his family. I'm sure he has a great surgeon and, and hopefully can get really good rehab and physical therapy, which at his elite level will be required to go back to play. So, once again, guys, uh, any questions or concerns? Do not hesitate to reach out to me here and send me a message on uh, Instagram or TikTok at uh, Kissimmee Foot Doc. And uh, talk to you guys later. Have a great day.